What's up, guys? It's me. <coughs> it's me. It's Captain e 3 e once again with another aircraft review video. Right now, you are staring at a KLM Royal Dutch Airlines Boeing 777-200 in the 1-200 scale. Excuse me. In the 1-200 scale by Skymarks. All right. A little, a little history. <coughs> about KLM, uh, how this airline came into existence. KLM, Royal Dutch Airlines, was established in 1919 and is one of three of the oldest airliners, along with uh, Qantas and Avianca. Their, their main hub is out of Amsterdam Schiphol, with destinations in both in Europe, Africa, South America, the U.S., Mexico, and Asia. Now, this is my third 777 from KLM. And the Boeing customer code for this aircraft right here is 06. Alright, let's have a look around the aircraft, shall we? Stack ports, PO tubes, the cockpit windshield, and windshield wipers. The 777-200 is powered by two General Electric GE90 turbofan engines. There you see the Sky Team livery right there next to the L1 door. I'll pan my camera up a little bit. I'll bring it along the port side of the aircraft. I'll hold it right there so you can get a better look at the aircraft. <clears throat> and the registration number on this aircraft, Papa Hotel Bravo Foxtrot Juliet. Is the registration number on this aircraft? Very nicely detailed by Skymarks. Boeing 777. That's right there at the tail. KLM on the tail. Now let's take over to the APU. To the auxiliary power unit. There you see the APU. I'll take it over to the port side. And over to the starboard side of the aircraft. KLM, right there on the tail. The registration number on this aircraft. The flag of the Netherlands. Which this is a, a Netherlands air carrier. I'll give you a nice shot from the tail angle. Put it right there so you get a better glimpse of the aircraft. <coughs> Come along the starboard side of the aircraft. Next to the galley door and the Air France KLM livery. Now, uh, how this came about was was that around <clears throat> in 2013, KLM and Air France had a joint merger between the uh, the two airlines and reportedly according to a Facebook posting that, uh, that Air France was going to break away from KLM Uh, 
I hope you like this aircraft. I know I do. Okay, guys, that's it for this video. I would like to say thank you very much for watching. Please rate, share, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. I'll see you next time with more aircraft review videos. Until next time, this is, this is Captain A3E, signing off for now. Have a great day.